Why is there a pipe coming through the ceiling? What is this? It's a drain. Inside. Why is there a drain into the house? Yeah, how do you feel about that? Um, everyone, my husband is being the cameraman today in our world of social distancing. All hands on deck. Uh, but at a safe distance, of course. So, cameraman. The reason there's a pipe that essentially drains into the house um, is that we're standing underneath of the portico. So um, those of you who maybe haven't been here since, say, 2016, might remember this looking a little bit different. You would remember seeing concrete over my head, lots and lots of gray Portland cement, and not this beautiful um, wood that you see here. So. Um, we had to do a lot of work on this portico a couple of years ago. Between 2011 and 2016, we did a huge project and essentially took this whole thing apart and put it back together very carefully. Why? Because there was a lot of water getting into it um, and doing a lot of damage, among other things. It was more complicated than that. But in putting the portico back together, we had to think about what would this deck overhead be? So it was not going to be concrete. Um, we decided we're going to use wood. We were able to find all the original joist pockets. So the places for these guys to go into the masonry wall, those are called joist pockets. And all the originals were there from when Drayton Hall was first built. That was very exciting. So we've used those again. We put wood in there, but we know that the water's still going to come through. And water getting on this wood is not good. Um, it's been a problem from the beginning since they first built this portico. We can see evidence um, of the wood just like this rotting time and time again. It's probably why they switched to concrete. So the drains are there to catch water that gets into this floor system overhead and get it away. We've never seen water come through these and that's good because we've done lots of sneaky things to keep the water out of this system. Um, if you go up above, you'll see beautiful stones, really nice uh, stone floor on the first floor of the portico. Underneath of those stones, basically sandwiched between those and what's over my head right now, there's an ice and water shield, two drainage mats, uh, two mortar beds, um, weep holes all the way along the front, and six copper drains. So, in theory, the water should really never get to those drains, but if they do, um, yeah, we'll have a little bit of drippy water in here, but it's been four years since we finished this. I haven't seen it happen yet. I'm feeling pretty good about it. 